From DailyDoseOfWeirdNews.com, I'm Darren Marlar, and this is your Daily Dose of Weird News. When a Vietnam man went into surgery after being in a car accident, doctors were surprised to find a pair of scissors in his stomach that had been left there in a previous surgery 18 years ago. Man, no wonder he was complaining about a sharp pain in his gut. He had something sharp in his gut! Researchers have identified a gene that can cause symptoms of major depression and said it might be possible to use gene therapy to counteract its effects. Yeah, genes too tight on me? That gives me the blues, too. The new president of South Korea has a bodyguard who is so handsome he has become an overnight heartthrob. Protesters are demanding to be frisked. There is research that indicates the active ingredient that gives chilies their kick can surround cancer cells and kill them off, which could help develop a cure for cancer. Unfortunately, the cancer pills leave your mouth on fire and no amount of water seems to relieve that. A company in Japan has installed smartphone wipes in restrooms at Tokyo International Airport. They've even posted a helpful instructional video on how to use Japanese toilets as well as the new smartphone wipes. Yeah, th this might work in Japan, but here in the U.S., this would go horribly wrong. Somebody would get confused, think that the smartphone wipe is a wet wipe, then they'd have to be rushed to the emergency room because something went wrong with their rumpus. Right now, you can get a free copy of the book None Other by John MacArthur by visiting MarlarHouse.com slash free stuff. Grow deeper in your knowledge of the one true God. Get the book free right now at MarlarHouse.com slash free stuff or click the Free Stuff tab at DailyDoseOfWeirdNews.com. Offer expires June 2nd. Around 20% of Americans are on internet almost constantly. All right, fess up. You're listening to me on the web right now, aren't you? Uh-huh, I thought so. Well, while we're on the internet, a survey of America's commuters reveals some interesting and dangerous facts. Chief among them, many more folks text and drive than we previously thought. At least I think that's what the story said. You know, it was kind of hard to read it on my phone while driving into the office this morning. High school students spend three hours or more on the average school day playing video or computer games or using a computer for something other than schoolwork. Although it can be argued that these kids were simply preparing for the future and will be more ready than the rest of us when the inevitable zombie apocalypse finally does take place. An Australian helicopter pilot with the munchies landed his chopper next to a McDonald's to grab some food. Saturday, the pilot landed his chopper on the lawn next to a McDonald's, got out of the aircraft, entered the restaurant to get food, got back into his helicopter, and flew away. See, now this is why we need McDrone delivery to be a thing, like yesterday. The latest United Airlines incident? Access codes to the cockpit doors on United planes were made public. I gotta tell you, the hardest job in the world right now has to be the United Airlines PR director. You couldn't pay me enough for that job. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and be sure to subscribe if you want to see more. And click that little bell icon next to the subscribe button to be notified when I post new videos. And if you're already an official weirdo, please share this video on your own social media. Hey, have you signed up for the Marler Sheet? It's free, and everyone who subscribes is automatically entered into monthly drawings for prizes. For this month, May 2017, I'm giving away a Daily Dose of Weird News t-shirt and mug combo, and you can sign up for the Marler Sheet free at DailyDoseOfWeirdNews.com. Find even more weird news that I didn't have time for on the Facebook page at DailyDoseOfWeirdNews.com. I'm Darren Marler, and I'll see you next time, weirdos!